So, you ready? All right, we're gonna do another Christmas catalog. This is our third annual one, but not in consecutive years. So it's been- It hasn't even been consecutive years that we've been recording. No, it's been two years since the last one we did. Three. Three? Pretty right. sure it's been three. It was 2019. That's two Christmases ago. It was, it was not 2019. Yeah. No, it was like 2018. That was the one before. No, I checked yesterday. Okay, anyway. Anyway. So this is for J.C. Penney Christmas Catalog 1994, which came out before the two of you were even born. Yeah, yeah. we have a special guest. And there. you can see that it was four dollars. If you, I don't know if you got this. It's on you, the front too. Yeah, it's on the front. Got a little barcode and everything to pay, make you pay for it. Yes, I don't know what state this one's from, so maybe we'll look at oh, that. The 1992 end. was two years ago. The 1983 one you guys said was three years ago. Yeah, that was that was just on the Wish Book. Dot com. So if people want to look at catalogs, they can just look at them on there because now if you try and buy a catalog, we just saw a service merchandise one go for what, $70 plus shipping? Plus shipping. Yeah. yeah so, and service merchandise is rare. Yes. I, I would have liked to have got that one, but probably the last one I'd like to get. So we will just start by flipping it open and see where where this goes. It's a nice cover, right? Yeah, same I, 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 I like the... Uh, I like that it's a drawing. Yeah, I like the drawings better than the photos mm -hmm. but and I think JC Penny tend to use drawings more on hey covers? let's say $15. 15 dollars yes do you remember on the rather. on the Sears one you called the number yeah you made me but JC Penny's still open so <laughs> they'll answer it probably probably not. ask for operator JP 94 you could do that <laughs> I like the whole and it you would had be to order by October 14th <laughs> to, to make sure you're getting your discount of that it's it, early it's yeah. October 14th 1994 we're, I think we're a little bit past the 50% uh, yeah. so we'll be looking at the styles it's starting right out with the uh, women's fashion it looks like Valor. it's velvet velvet yeah Valor, Costanza would have liked that isn't that what it is maybe he likes velour yeah there's more of it it's just yeah. green and black and um, I didn't I never saw people wear this stuff and I don't recall well JC Penny has it always been like a bit of a old lady kind of look to their clothing now? Um, Sears had the even older lady fashion. I know Kohl's has that kind of look. It's hard for it's hard for women in their what mid twenties and up to find stuff that's kind of fashionable these days. Well, or anywhere. Your definition of fashion, I think. Well, see, that's not so bad, right? That's not yeah, those fair. those those types of sweaters were um, everywhere. You can see she's wearing stirrup pants. But think too, about the on the left. <laughs> right. Think about the cost, though. That's about the same cost as things are now, right? Clothing is cheaper now, I believe. Is it? I think it depends. Well, because on the because of the value of the dollar. It depends on well, the brand name. It, looks it like depends on brand. if you're buying it the, on sale. The cable net is actually really, really beautiful. I totally would wear that. I wonder how much of this was made um, See, that, out of the country. It's, it's the professional women's looking stuff that I guess leaves so. a little bit to be desired. Well, that's not bad. I mean... Well, the top's not, but the... the one on I the really one. like this. This really? blue right here. Yeah. The blue? The crossover. Yeah, I like that too. Hmm. It's just, it's a little different without being anything... Oh yeah, not over the top. Yeah, other than the fleets on that one, that was... Yeah, there's some plat... What is it? Hound's tooth that they call it. That short hairdo. Pants were a lot. Yeah, short Wasn't that hair. a that's, pretty popular hairdo around that's then? That's pretty much what I had for our hairdo when I graduated high school. The cut of pants has changed so much oh, yeah. for women. I feel like some of my favorite pairs of pants are ones that I've thrifted because they allow for more room like in the hips and then still give like that. They're, they're not as hugging. Yes. Yes, we've gotten to the point where all the pants are designed to misshape you. Actually, they're, they're, they ride lower. They they have to be tighter and cinched in. And yeah. Yeah, definitely. Which which created the oh, muffin dresses with oh shoulder gosh. pads. <laughs> but but I think I think the designs of two thousand created a lot of muffin top. Uh, yes. Builds where people squeezed and misshaped themselves. And that's very Sergeant Pepperish. What this? The vest. Oh, the oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is. Okay, so this and is. So you, in the early '90s, hats, those patterns, the vests, those were all still very popular. Like those, yeah. Yeah, the hats and vests started to make a comeback actually when Debbie Gibson. <laughs> right. In the airways. I don't know who Debbie Gibson. Is. Uh, but she was in the mid '80s. Oh, those kind of woven shoes. 
Oh, here we go. This is what leisure wear used to look like before, you know, well, yeah. before yoga pants. Yoga <laughs> pants, yeah, which have taken over. Not that they didn't exist, and but this, yeah, they were kind of getting a little frumpy here, huh? Yeah. There's just something so old feeling about, I, I guess, like the, the shades of colors. Mm. Oh, and this stuff? Yeah. Well, you know, Some the 90s was almost 20 years ago now. I mean, 1990 was over 20 years ago. Mickey Mouse jacket's fun. You know? 1999 was... No, this is all really cute. The Mickey Mouse stuff would no, all still sell today. Right? Mm -hmm. Honestly, <laughs> no. No, it's, it's hard. I'm, I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah. No, over 20 it's years ago. It's been over 20 years, years for ago. any of the 90s. Wow. I'm... Yeah, you, you were born in the late 90s, so obviously... Yes. <laughs> Am I 20 years old? I don't act like it. Oh, that was a fancy snowsuit. All color coordinated for going skiing in. Yeah, that that's yeah. something that you would have seen in Dumb and Dumber, right? I they were wearing stuff like that. Season. When was Dumb and Dumber out? Ah, sometime in the nineties, right? Yeah, that was that was had to be a nineties film because this is exactly what they were wearing in that. Mock turtlenecks. Am I going too fast? Nineteen ninety four. Right. We're in Dumb jewelry. Dumber. We're the same year this was out. This yeah. catalog. Yeah. Maybe they shot from J C Penney for that full movie. Oh. Yeah. Lots of lots of jewelry options that are. Um, more budget friendly, I guess, for most people than a fancy yeah. jewelry store at Christmas time. A lot more um, big and clunky. Everyone's trying to go minimalist nowadays. Or if you're if you're going big, you're going for this vintage kind of look. This is, this is the stuff that a lot a of grandmothers have, have right now. Yes, the oh, hoops are completely different. Just like rings and necklaces. I, I think what that the heck are these? Large hoops have always been mason. No, they look like yeah, they look like they're for masons. They're uh, super yeah, boring. Men's synthetic sapphire ring. That's all it's called. Hey, look at this. Did you see the, the football hose down here? Oh, yeah. 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 So, um, it used to be the rage Pass. in the early 90s that guys would wear chains that were just good enough to get a pendant that was either it was some sort of sports related pendant on it. Wait, they wouldn't just wear a chain, they'd actually have something they'd hanging get a, from they'd it? They'd get a pendant on That's it. not a man. Mickey Mouse watches. Look at these. Wow, he's even got ears on that, the dopey one. Yeah, we, Elvis was still one, popular in the 90s. I don't think he is anymore, really. Do you? I don't know. I, don't, I got I, a couple of Elvis songs saved on Spotify. Well, yeah, but I mean, Elvis jewelry, no. yeah, not Elvis jewelry or you know, memorabilia paintings. Yeah. No so. Sports man. Is that like a mosquito? So, uh oh. oh. We're getting into the. Uh, this is before you know Victoria's Secret was mainstream. Well, were they? <laughs> I think they existed, but I don't think they were like a, a gift shopping destination like they are now for Valentine's Day or Christmas. They only have one page because they knew that if you gave, you know, a young teenage, you know, or a younger boy. Yeah, these are the kind right? of um, pajamas. Circle that, what you want. They <laughs> wanted it right away. What is this? That's horrible. That's quite the Christmas outfit, huh? Oh my God. Christmas jammies. Is this. That's a part of that. What is I, going I think on with that? Yeah, you have multiple options. That's just the uh, accessory. One is kind of cute. Yep. So Today those things would be sold, but they'd all be made out of a fuzzy material. Mm -hmm. So this is definitely very different from the Sears catalog, which it's Sears had shoes. a lot less clothing. Right. And J.C. Penney, you can see, is very heavy on awesome. apparel. And there's the luggage section, which was always at the back of a JCPenney near the bathrooms, yeah. right? Okay. Where you could actually order at their desks back there when they used to have people at them. Now you walk to the back of a JCPenney's and it's just a big open area to their back door. That's oh, good lord. Your own at home hair dryer, huh? Oh, my goodness. These things are dangerous. That's a tanning thing. Yeah. I don't think it works that good like that because it's not, it's too much focus on one spot. Yeah, I've seen this side there. Yeah. Here we go. Maybe some fun stuff. We're getting into the yeah, kids' those, Look at these. What are these? these? I used to get things like that for Christmas. There's, oh, there's a Barney down here. It's hard to see. Oh, What's down there? The, what are you looking No, it's the other. Oh, what? it's the Triceratops. Yeah. yeah. DJ? Sure. Yeah, because that's on his screen, right? Here's BJ. You were so oh, close. BJ. Okay. They called it BJ. <laughs> Come on. It is a nice. <sighs> the big purple dinosaur and those are some kids outfits for taking pictures in oh yeah Boy, look at those bold colors check this out oh the bottom right hand corner one looks familiar 
I they, feel like there's baby pictures. There was still a slight chance in that era that you wouldn't get beat up for having a, something like that. I, I feel like I feel like I've been, I've had pictures taken of something. Of like something like that. Yeah, I think you do have something with a very like like that's really strong like colors. Colors, boy colors, kind of. Primary bold. Yes, and blue and red and green. Are the, I feel like I had pajamas thing. like that too, except was, not for lunch. Was the Lion King big in '94? The Lion King Is that when came, it came out, out in. Because mean, or '95. Well, this is '94, so had it had to. Lion King came out in '94. Wow. Was Look at this. Yes. What's oh, that remind you? Wow. I, I, it reminds me of a toy line or something like. Yeah. Not Polly Pockets or something, you know. Yeah. They, they decided they to dress like up. Outfits, it, but they do. On oh, you mean like the American Girl doll? Elmo. We're a couple of years yeah. away from Tickle Me Elmo being the most popular yes. toy on the market. Elmo became big in the '90s. He was kind of a uh, what side character, right? He was a Bert and Ernie like Christmas theme looking sweater over there. Yes, this. It's not really Christmas theme, but it kind of looks like. This. More shoes and boots. Yeah, these are all kids' shoes and boots. And some of them are modeled exactly after. So this Elvers. this probably was very huge, huh? In Arizona, do they still make Arizona they do. stuff? Yeah, yeah. They Arizona still jeans they, used they to be really them. comfortable, and jean jackets and stuff. But I don't know. We don't have one close enough to go to anymore. Well, it's close enough, but it's a small one. Yeah, yeah the Waterville one's very small. The Lewiston one's still pretty big. Oh, there we go. Family, all the church family stuff. outfits for yeah. your time. They look thrilled. Mm -hmm. That's how many times you had to wear outfits like so that. that's, that, the look. that's the kind of look that my sister was wearing in high school. The hair pulled back, the choker necklace, the long, the shapeless face. dress, and the dis disenfranchised face. <laughs> you know, what used to be the worst as a kid was when, you know, because my mother would try to dress us up in, like, our, our clothes from Ireland, so our Irish wool sweaters yeah. and, like, the kilt, and it was just so itchy. Yes. Like, it's so annoying oh. as a child. And I've got... There's no itch. Easy. Oh, gosh. Yeah, you, you, you put on a little sweater and say that. <laughs> I've oh, got there's... a lot of sensitivity issues with clothes. That's 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 how um, they were trying to get girls into sports back then, was outfits like that. Now they... Well, and they've done it now. They've I mean, got, they've think got of... more feminine stuff now for women rather than buying all the men's clothes. Yeah, but think of the commercials you see during, like, NFL games and stuff for the, the clothing. It's, yes. it's definitely geared... Just as much towards women as men now. Yes. Wow. Oh, that's that quite the jacket. It is a jacket. Those are some fancy ones on the right side. This looks like, uh, what's her name? The cartoon? Madeline. Madeline. Thank you. Very similar is to that. Is she yellow? Yeah, but it's the... Her hat was yellow. Her coat was blue. Mm, that's what I was asking you. I might even find I a jacket in here that I had Halloween once we get to the, <laughs> the main oh, section. Look, Lucy's pulling the football out from <laughs> That looks comfortable. The Timberlands, the jeans, and a baggy sweatshirt. Oh, this is what this is what guys looked like section. during away basketball games when I was in high school. Hmm? The pleated that, pants. Everyone had the, to wear the yeah, shoes the dress, and dress the belt. Shoes. Yeah. I always thought that was crazy that they made everyone dress up like that for I away it. games. Yeah, it's... We had to dress up for home games and away games. I hated it. Every second of it. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. It was dumb. In soccer, the best we would do was go to school wearing our jersey. You get up dressed up all nice to go to another school to make a good impression, and then you get out on the court and you just get abused physically. And then, you know, like you Back said... Back in the 90s, you'd go home. If you lost, you get abused physically, too. Yeah. You're playing... Well, what is... What's with this? Let's Larry, see. Grandma, John. Oh, remember he did commercials? That's right. He did commercials like that. They were probably for Nike or something. Yeah, the guy, he was on the Hornets, right? Yeah. Maybe it was Nike, maybe it wasn't, but I vaguely remember those commercials. You were saying some of these teams don't exist. Well, like that one, the Charlotte Hornets is not the Charlotte Hornets anymore. They moved and I don't think was the Hornets even there. I don't no, know. I think they have lost track. Yeah. The Pelicans. Is that what it is? The Pelicans. Much more dangerous than a Hornet. Mm -hmm. Murder Pelicans. Fuzzy blankets. Er. 
Well, because there's the Bobcats, too. Okay. I, I lost track when I stopped paying attention to sports ages ago. Yeah. It was somewhere in the 90s, mostly. Wow. That's some... Memorabilia. Older memorabilia. Yeah. I wonder if this stuff has had any increase in value. Right. Probably not. Because, you know, it's not official stuff and sports impressions yeah a lot of people must have bought tons of stuff though from franklin JC Penny. big league baseball electronic encyclopedia stats for every player i bet it's outdated now there you go reproduction team rings yeah just like the one we saw on bernie mac replica helmets Oh no, they were the Charlotte Hornets, then they moved and became the Charlotte Bobcats, but now they're the Charlotte Hornets again. So the New Orleans Pelicans are just somebody they're, else. They're the Charlotte Hornets again. Yeah. Okay. Because the New Orleans Pelicans are just a different team. What are these things up here? Are these some game, some sort of game? I know Oklahoma City Thunder used to be the team. Sporting gifts for bracket. Standings. It is. It's bracket stuff. Interesting. I never knew such a thing existed. Is that a rug? That's a pretty cool rug. Seven like the sports teams. It's a throw rug. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That'd be cool to have on the floor when you were yeah. younger. Because yeah. I always loved having a little hoop in my house. the basketball court? This year? What if they're just big? What if those kids are huge? Like those, it's hard those to tell. Those are so close together, though. That's what? Like five by five? Ten by ten? It's not very big. No. These jackets were very prominent. Yes. Big kind. Yeah. Like oh my goodness, jackets. it's actually Troy yeah, Aikman. Yeah, Troy Aikman, yeah. He's leaning in like he's with these guys, but he's not with them. <laughs> he knows he's not. He's in another Troy league. Aikman. Well, he was a, a quarterback for the Dallas Cowboys. Now he's an announcer for football. Yeah, oh, they won a couple times. Yeah, they won when Buffalo went four years in a row and lost every ah, time. one of those, <laughs> they won two yeah. Of them. Dallas won two of them. Yeah. Poor I know Jim. you don't care, but your family's Poor Jim upset Kelly. if they watch this. No, it was... It was brutal. They went... I rooted for Buffalo every year yeah, they went. Yeah, I think I did, I, too. I thought Jim Kelly deserved it, so... Yeah. Those are some interesting shoes. She has been around for a long time. Wow. I missed this section in the store, thank goodness. See, they used to have so many different, like, now. Oh, those for sure. Stonewashed. Now they've got, like, bleached and ripped and. Ripped. We used to have to rip them ourselves back then. Yes. They'd have to wear out and then you keep them. I'll, I'll be impressed if there is a pair in here of, uh, like, ripped jeans or something, because that did become a thing. Yeah. Oops, I hit two. Nope. All those reversible ones, yep, remember that. If you wore it on some, you, you might want to flip it inside out to have the pattern out and that could line around the jacket. Oh, those are some fun men's pants. The jeans were even pleated. Oh no, <laughs> that is not a good look. Those are like mom jeans on that men. Is not oh <laughs> boy. I wish you wouldn't have noticed now. I, I flipped back you for that. You can't unsee it, huh? She's like, wow, what? Oh my gosh. There are tens of men out there throwing away their pleated jeans right now because of us commenting on it. <laughs> tens of them. <laughs> oh, wow. Those are some sweaters. Yeah, the colors definitely are a certain era, huh? Mm. Uh oh. It was party time. Like, that was all like fancy right, business all New Year clothes. stuff. When are we going to get to the actual fun stuff? I feel bad. Yeah, well, it's, that's what I mean. That's how the catalogs work. This is, this is, uh, this is not Sears. Sears sold so much crap. They could have not just closed through half their catalog. Yeah, but looking at all that crap, it was more fun to look at that crap than just look at Well, you stuff. don't want to look at fancy boxer shorts? Boxer short guy? Silk boxer short guy? <laughs> Mickey Mouse face? He looks pretty happy with himself. <laughs> Smug. Give a smug Fancy boxer words. short guy. You got it. Hey, is that boxer short guy again? Is Was he? Uh, in a bathroom now? That might be. I'm going to try to get them all to, you know, do their best Hugh Hefner impression. Right. Nobody ties up their uh, robe, eh? <laughs> Except this guy. He knows where it's at. Oh, uh, that is never going to happen, just so you know. <laughs> Those are some... Want me to get you a nightshirt? 
Wow. Crazy. You'll probably get visited by three ghosts mm -hmm. after wearing something like that. Either that or you're a wizard. Right. I don't know, I'm pretty sure. He likes a healthy breeze. What's the, uh, what's like the spell for wind? Friend, friend That's here, what Shaggy and Scooby Doo wore a, a night they did. gown yeah. instead of pajamas. I think it was Shaggy. But I think Fred had. Long sleeve. All right, this is this is the kind of area that's now like in What's a. What's with those socks? I, I don't Does know. It have like a pocket. It does. It looks like it has a pocket yeah, for what's a the deal lighter. With those hands. They, they're holding something. What do you mean? Holding what? A remote. It's a remote. Are they selling the remote or the hands? The hands. The holder. It's like Let's see. F F uh. is. It says remote hands. Remote hands. That's exactly what they are. Remote hands. That's creepy. Uh, to think that even two of those sold, right? Ah, here we go. We're getting educational. Steins. I remember Steins oh, yeah. used to be big there. They used to sell a lot of Steins. Ooh, that, that globe's fancy. It's on a pole. It's a, it's a standing globe. What is oh. this thing? Oh, they've had those that long? It's one of those 3D... 3D puzzles? Yeah. Huh. They've had puzzles that long, eh? A Star Trek game? Yeah, it looks like a game, not a puzzle down there. Many like, slot machines. Oh, I don't know slots. why people love slot machines so much, but they Chess, do. Chess, checkers, dominoes. Yep. Yeah. used to have one of those when I was little. The labyrinths. Oh, I you ever, you ever had one of those? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a dad's. Yeah. They're fun a little bit, but they're tr they're tricky, but they're fun. Gumball machines. Yeah. Oh, there's the gift tins. Yep, yeah, that don't don't Zuka exist anymore. Joe tin. Popcorn oh, it was. Exist, but they're they are small. Smaller. They're really small. Yeah. I would want the Notre Dame one. I, I noticed that at, at work we got popcorn tins in, but they're half the size they used to be. Look at all this sporting equipment. Oh, how much has that advanced over the years, huh? Oh, yeah. I mean, that's pretty fancy for back then still. I mean, 200 bucks isn't that bad. No. Well, you gotta oh. buy all the weights. And that's, separate. that's what we get people. They'd be like, oh, yeah, I can put that right in my living room. Like music, uh, yeah. and then you they start buy hanging it clothes and, on it. Yep. Let's move it on. Pool, I there's anything wrong with that. What is the octagon? Oh, that's just a Hexagon. bumper pool. Bumper pool? Yep. Yeah. Air hockey? That one converts, huh? It's a ping oh, pong yeah. table. No, over here. Oh, over there? Table yeah. Ends. Oh, that's got chest and checkers on it or cards, you know. Who's calling? Oh, look. Knives. Yes. yes. Who are you giving a knife to for Christmas? <laughs> Something you trust with your life, evidently. I guess. Not your friend who just got out of prison for stabbing somebody. Hey, Stabby. <laughs> guess what I got you for <laughs> Christmas? A knife? You know it. Are those bean bags? Bean bags. Oh, okay. okay. I thought they were like the boppums so that you would put on your Oh, jeez. But they had like sports logos on them. Just you want to beat someone with your own. Like, who do you think's going to win the Super Bowl this year? I don't know. Let's put on the Bills <laughs> and the Cowboys and duke it out. That's all uh, Ricky Schroeder, right? Yeah. Very... That's what our bed's going to look like in the future. <laughs> it's going to be a race car. With lamb chop on it. I don't know if anyone knows what lamb chop is anymore. <laughs> You know who Lamb Chop is? They don't remember ever Ooh, fancy fireplace stuff. Make you look like you got a... I did not part. know they had so much. Oh yeah, they probably got a lot of this stuff for yeah, dinnerware. Oh, Ooh, these Christmas are nice China. actually. Mm -hmm. well, I think my mother had a, a one Christmas dish set, but I don't know if it was one of those or not. The yeah. trees look familiar to me. The problem is, is keeping stuff like that in good shape when you're having company, you know? You pull it out once a year and it's destroyed. Well, you, you do like Monica Keller and you hide it for the queen and until the queen comes to <laughs> queen. The queen is welcome here. Yeah, Everybody's welcome. Now this is something you would not see as porcelain dolls. <laughs> this is stuff you see on QVC now. This is yeah. not a happy dog. This is the stuff you see in photos of a guy that nightmare to a mental yeah. asylum. This is the nightmare fuel. There's right a here. huge collection of these. Porcelain dolls. Oh, those are interesting. The Barbie plates. Oh, that's the yeah. The collectible doll. Interesting. 
these things people precious bought moments. like crazy. Yeah. We have one of those now, you know? You have a precious moment? My grandparents got a lot after my grandfather's mother died. Yeah. And when we went down for vacation, they said we could take one back. So we just got a couple of people in the boat. I wanted the cowboy, but Claire wasn't having it. <laughs> Why did you want the cowboy? Because he was a cowboy. That nativity set down there is kind of like the one my, mo my yeah. mom had. Little houses. Coke stuff. I Coke think stuff. I actually, my mom still has that kind of a set. It's a nice they, little they one. They grow Christmas for us. <laughs> yeah, it, Trees. It's, it's very, like... Authentic I don't remember. Are your parents older than mine? Yeah. yeah. I think so. You think so? That's it. Why are they selling Halloween stuff? This, I don't know. This came out before Halloween, probably. Out, yeah. If you had to get your discount by October 14th, you still could have gotten something. All those plastic things. Yeah. Now everything's an inflatable. Yes. Yeah. All those plastic things. Are... They're, ho they're horrible. Yeah. They are. And they look horrible. I'm looking like a caricature wow. family that looks like it's from Britain and the Scrooge era. That's when all of Christmas takes place. Break that is a fancy bathroom. That's Which a one? bathroom? Why is this? there carpet oh, on the floor? Yeah, oh that one, yeah. What? Yeah, but it's absorbable carpet. It looks like a big looks like a giant towel. Mass mats and carpet? It's just like mold waiting to happen. Mm-hmm. This is disgusting. That's Man, too fancy. What was wrong with the nineties? Fancy mold. Put the carpet in the kitchen, carpet in the bathroom. Quilt. Ooh, oh, Christmas these are time. nice. Tapestries. You know, I, I don't think want it's one. Holding it's holding it up nice. there on the wall. I need like five of those. Those, yeah. <laughs> What'd they cost? We can't find those anymore. All right. D and E. D. Shaker peg design. No, that's the thing. Oh. E. What's yeah. E? Choose any combination. Da, 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 pay that's the price. No, it's, I think it's everything. Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe that's not available. Oh, no. It's the hanger. Look. Any size. 40 bucks. It's probably double that now. Yeah, you got a bunch of Harry Potter ones that would be cool to hang. Mm, oh, I like that sleigh one. That's neat. Color is over there. Who puts a Christmas tree in their bedroom? Rich people? People who live in studio apartments. That's <laughs> because <laughs> everything's in their bedroom. This is this is the kind of people where someone comes in and you know if you're in a studio apartment brings them breakfast. In your they get breakfast brought to them and someone pulls their sheets down for them to get out of bed and then has their clothes laid or out for them. Or if you have Christmas in a hotel, like in McAllister. No, that's true. They probably do that. Well, blue moose, is this a thing? I don't know. It is. It says blue moose. Hmm. Was that a thing? I don't know. That eventually became blue moose. Blue moose. Wait, I'm going to shift this to the other side. So. Here. I'll make sure it's straight. All right. We've lost all our lighting, so this will probably get darker, but I'll do an adjustment. You've been standing in front of lighting the entire time. Yeah, but that just breaks glass. Curio cat. This stuff is I so like expensive. The chairs. Oh, the gliders? I, I do like yeah. them. Yeah, gliders are nice. Very nice. They're comfy. They break apart a lot eventually, but especially if you use them, which is, you know. What there you want to do? Like we had one here at one time, didn't we? I think I got one for my mother, and she probably got it from JC Penny. Grandfather hope chests. I've always liked rolling desks. I always like big clocks like that. Grandfather clocks, Hulu clock. I always like them. I hate our stupid boring little. See, it's really weird to put like a fancy table with a TV and a VCR. Yes. Very bizarre. Tell you what, when you see one of holes in the walls, I'll let you do some more interesting work. We don't need holes in the walls if we get a grandpa. No, but you gotta move it. You don't, you don't have four space yet, for that. So. <laughs> the thing about moving is it's horrible. Oh, I like that kitchen wow. set. You, you like, like the, the green? green? You do? Yeah. We can put the secret passage See, to the that'd be nice if you had a cottage somewhere. We don't, have, we don't have a... Okay. We don't have a cottage. Yeah. When we get one, we'll you get one. You've never seen... Green. We need to get a, a, a cottage. No, I'm a just cottage. interested that you imagine a future house having a secret passage to the basement. Well, I always have to be a secret passage to the basement, but we need to have a secret room so that we can... I always wanted to make a bookshelf on that door down there. 
so that when it opened it looked like a bookshelf, but then it went into the movie room. Yeah. Never got around to it. I don't know. You can call. You can call to find out. I think these are forms you'd send in, see? Oh, but these are shiny. It, it looks like dull paper, but it's not. Here's the index if anyone wants to. The toy, toy index. index. Versus the oh, this is just the. Yeah. And then there's a general index. Well, why do they put the toy index before the general when the general is clearly everything we just went through? 